TFNN. Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials down 25. You get the Nasdaq up 2. S&Ps are down 2.5. Gold contracts up $4.20 trading at eleven eighty nine. even. You have silver up 15 cents, $16.84. Platinum is up a buck at nine seventy eight. You have uh, copper. Copper's got quite a bid. Up eight pennies at two sixty two a pound. Light sweet crude flat at fifty two dollars and fifteen cents a barrel. Bonds. The ten year note up one tick, one twenty four twenty six. Thirty year bond down four ticks, one fifty two nineteen. Both the ten and the thirty year folks rejected lower price once again yesterday. Had lighter volume. Move forward. Notes and bonds want higher price, lower yield. King dollar. King dollar down 179 ticks, trading at 101.730. King dollar is in a potential ABC structure on the way down. We'll see how it goes after the B point. Right now, it is going uh, lower, and you do have volume expanding. Uh, the price projection is uh, 99,970. Uh, we get under 100.600 in that King dollar, folks. That would be a false break topside from the consolidation that started in March of 2015. Euro, the euro is at 105 and the yen is trading at 115.58. We go over and we take a look at the S&P. What they're looking at is this. You had a sideways move yesterday, had light volume, same type of setup today. Bottom line is that we'll see if, if the volume does not expand, even in a subtle way, meaning that you don't get big price destruction, but the volume expands as you're down 20, 30 cents. Uh, that's saying that this S&P still wants to go test its highs. Uh, Dow Industrials. What do you have with the Dow Industrials? Same type of setup in the Dow. Bottom line, Dow goes down yesterday, dramatically well, light volume. Um, you know, we, we'll see how this volume shakes out today, but that's also saying that the Dow Industrials still wants to tag that 20,000 level. Um, NASDAQ Composite. Now, the Composite went to a high, had dramatically lighter volume. Uh, the Composite, uh, bottom line, we are at 5434. Uh, we hit 54, 55, 55.34 rather. We hit 55.41.03 uh, today. 55.41.07 was the high of yesterday. So we'll see where that volume comes in. Gold contract. What do you have with the gold contract? Gold contract, folks, trading at a price point of 11.89, and you have volume behind the move. We're already at 122,000 contracts. This baby will end up doing a couple hundred thousand contracts. Uh, gold looks to me like it wants to make the run to about 1221. Silver has finally caught a bid. Uh, what you have with silver, silver's trading at a price point of uh, 1682, uh, uh, making its way up to the swing of this uh, 1729. Uh, You've done 30 years, uh, 6,000 contracts thus far. So silver will uh, have some good volume out here today. Silver, I suspect, will do about 30, I mean 60, 60 to 70,000 contracts. Notes and bonds, they just continue to want higher price. Uh, yesterday, what you had, bottom line, is that rejected lower price. Notes did. Um, pretty amazing, but uh, that's, that's what they're doing, folks. They're building cars. They have wide price spread up at 125. Uh, looks like this 10-year wants to rent to 127.07. If we go to the 30-year and take a look at the 30-year, 30-year set up the same way. 30-year right now is at 152.16, and that's, that looks like it's building cars to get you know, right up into the November 9th downdraft. The bottom of that downdraft uh, is 155.13. I expect that's going to be the first place. And what do we have? It's all about King Dollar, folks. Uh, King Dollar is in a potential ABC structure on the way down. Uh, your B point on this King Dollar is uh, 101.295. Uh, we had big volume down there. That's where it broke down after testing its high. Um, you are coming down into that area again, and you're coming down with volume. I don't expect it's going to break it today. I expect what you're going to see it break it tomorrow. We'll get back under the 100 point. That would be a false break topside after consolidation that started in March of 2015. That would send King Dollar over the next year down to the 91 area. This 10 a.m. update is brought to you each and every day by EverBank. For more information on the products they offer, you can give them a call at 855-750-4051 or visit everbank.com forward slash T. F and N. Have a great day. Have a safe day. Look forward to speaking to you. Right back here tomorrow morning, 10 o'clock.
Today, it's hard to tell if the economy is coming or going. Regardless, I want my money going in the direction I choose. If that's your stance as well, then you want to know how EverBank can help keep your money thriving just the way you want. Is growing your money a priority? EverBank is committed to a yield pledge promise to pay high yields on your checking, money market, and CD balances. Looking to diversify? EverBank ingeniously developed accessible ways to spread your money around the world into foreign currencies and even non-FDIC insured metals. And when it comes to your wealth, they bring a highly experienced and global perspective to help you manage it. EverBank's financial philosophy flies in the face of the status quo. They believe your money's performance should not be determined by today's economic circumstances, but by the drive to rise above them and create opportunities that favor your objectives. If that excites you like it does me, call 1-855-750-4051 to find out what they can do for you. That's 1-855-750-4051. Call them today. EverBank. Bank is a member FDIC and equal housing lender. The path of least resistance is David.